Hey guys, finally back with another video today. Today's video will be on jailbreaking the iPod Touch 2nd generation with Green Poison. This now supports the iPod Touch 2nd generation, so it still jailbreaks your iPhone 4, iPod Touch 4, your iPhone 3GS, and your iPod Touch 3rd generation. But now it also supports the iPod Touch 2nd generation. I'm not quite sure when this is going to support the iPhone 3G, but let's get into this jailbreak video now that it now supports the second generation iPod. I'll have all the links below, just go to Green Poison's website and download it. This is for Windows, it is out for Mac as well. I'm not sure if I'm going to do a Mac review or jailbreak, but if I get enough comments below, I'll do a Mac one. So let's get into this jailbreak. Okay, so after once you open up Green Poison, you want to power off your device and make sure your iTunes is closed. So you're going to power off the device. And this is an iPod Touch 2nd generation. After once you've powered off your device, you can see Prepare to Jailbreak, DFU mode. As soon as you press Prepare to Jailbreak, it will come up, it will give you 3 seconds. After those 3 seconds, you have to hold your sleep button for about 3 seconds. Then it will tell you to hold down your home button as well for another 15, or 10 sorry. Then it'll tell you to release the power button and keep holding the home button. It's got all the directions on screen and you can restart the timer whenever you want. So let's prepare jailbreak. To start in three seconds, hold down the power button, hold down the home button for another eight seconds. Release the power button and keep holding the home button. This will put in DFU mode. Now, after once I've put in DFU mode, you want to press jailbreak. You should get a white screen. Might take a little bit. As you can see, you can see the green status bar down the bottom. You should get the Apple logo, connect to iTunes. So this is really good they got this out so quick. As you can see, the bar down the bottom. So it's still jailbreaking. It's a very simple jailbreak, one of the best out there. As you can see, you should get all this. You need to wait for all this to go through. Don't press quit on your screen until this is all done. So this might take a little bit. Just give it a bit of time. It's jailbreaking your device. And now your device has just been jailbroken. You should get the Apple logo again. So all the directions and links will be down in the more info for you guys. So again, this is for the 4.1 firmware only. And this will work on your iPad on 3.2.2. So connected to iTunes now. Go on to it, scroll across. You should have a thing called loader. I'll be back in a minute, I just need to connect this to Wi-Fi. Sorry about that guys, now connected to Wi-Fi. You should be right to close green poison now by pressing quit. And in loader, you want to open it. It should say loading sources. And you want to press Cydia. And you want to go install Cydia. See there. Downloading. It should download reasonably quick depending on your internet speed. I've got a pretty good internet, so it should download pretty quick.
that's extracting and after once this is installed it should reboot your iPod now it says do you want to remove loader from your device I'm gonna remove and then if you give it a sec it's gonna reboot your device press the home button get through to that and so after once you press your home button it will go back to screen, your icons will be blank and then it will reboot your device and Cydia will be there so it's pretty nice simple jailbreak and now we're just waiting for the support for the iPhone 3G to come out Slide to unlock, and there you have it. There's Cydia, and now I've got a jailbroken iPod Touch second generation. If you want to know if yours is second generation or not, on the back of your iPod, don't know if you can see it there, it's a bit scratched. The gig sign will be bigger than the iPod Touch 3G. The 3G will have a smaller one, and that's one way you can tell, but you should know or not if you have a iPod Touch second generation. If you bought yours in 2008, you've got a second generation iPod Touch. So there you have it, guys. That's how you put or get Cydia jailbreak your iPod with Green Poison on 4.1 on your iPod Touch second generation. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe for more videos. And if you'd like, if you'd like a Mac tutorial, uh, comment down below. That's about it. See you next time.